<sighs> Give me some time, Jesus. Check. Hey, there's a long way of running over there. I would like to have a boss jump. <laughs> would make things a lot better for me. Bap, 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 bap. You're dead. Take this. Now I'm gonna steal from your body. All of your six credits. Really must not pay well to be a soldier. All things considered. Jesus Christ. Now, kill it. Kill it with fire. Thank you, little Be careful. There's a whole squad of Sith. Hello there, little story. And welcome. To find some flowers. To their numbers. You could reprogram the damaged assault droid to help you. If you have enough repair parts. Stop being a star. You fucking store car class. Let me just do my thing. Use the Endar Spire's Jesus security Christ. systems against the Sith. What do you think I take a computer for? I know what I'm doing. Bitch. There's only one reason why you take computer. You see, you can look through the cameras and you can draw a hmm, overload power conduit. That sounds fun. Boom! See? Who's this fat man? It's not the only time you can do stuff like this. There are other times where you can poison other rooms and shit. Yeah, it's amazingly fun to do. And you still get the full XP for it anyway, so... <laughs> and I'm the frag grenade. Who's the fat man? Fat man is cast, probably. We're talking about this little lady here. She's not fat. I mean, she doesn't look fat. She has amazing underwear, though. <laughs> hmm, let's see here. 4 to 15 plus 5. 4 to 15 plus 5. Balanced. I killed them. Indeed, I killed them. Killed them most brutally. Look, I'm a lady. I can prove it. That's pretty easy to prove. I'm just going to my inventory. Look, would a man wear this sort of underwear? I'd be shamed. <laughs> You've made it just in time. You There's don't only say. one active escape pod left. Come on, yes. we can hide out on the planet I like being below. a monster. I can kill people. It's not like he hasn't introduced himself, but let's be an idiot, shall we? Who are you? I'm a soldier with the Republic. Like you. I'm We're not, though. I'm running away. Vassal's escape pod's already gone, so there's no reason for us to stick around here and get shot by the Sith. Now, come on. There'll be time for questions later. Sure. Whatever you say, Carl. Vassal's escape pod's already gone, so there's no reason for us to stick around here and get shot by the Sith. Now, come on! There'll be yeah, time yeah, for yeah, 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 you. Use the escape pod! Now, gonna open the video in another fucking window again that has another resolution. <laughs> oh, I hate old games sometimes. That's such a bitchy thing to do, though. And then we switch back, so basically, that's, actually, isn't there another video? Oh, this is so special. Oh, this is so bloody fucking specially made. <laughs> it amuses me greatly, though. And now, time for another video. Because, you know, screw you and everything you stand for. Like, ah, you want to stream this game? Hmm, yes, have fun there. And now we switch again to another one. <laughs> oh, fucking hell, okay. You really love being fucking special, don't you? Good to see you up instead of thrashing about in your sleep. You must have been having one hell of a nightmare. I was wondering if you ever going to wake up. I'm Carl. Well, just... One of the Republic soldiers. Will we be able to recapture this? I was with you on the escape. We should. Game is like, nah, I'm gonna make this special for you. And so we tap out and we tap in again. Josh game likes to be special. Mm -hmm -hmm -hmm. 
I guess you know. We could have it easy. But that would be boring. Uh, I feel the need to look for an option to disable fucking videos because those are going to screw with us royally. I'm not actually gonna do it much. Most of them are just more videos like that. Come on, game. I also come on software. Be nice to me. Uh, I'll be very happy if I don't have to watch any of those little videos for a while. Because, you know, you've seen what it does to you. Hmm. A very, very, very black screen. Which very, very, very much shouldn't be the case. <sighs> One of those cases where it's like, what have you done now, game? Why are you doing this to me? Yes. Uh... Okay, I can see that. What have I done to my desktop game? Seems like nothing. Would never dare to kill that. Hey, I can see the game again. <laughs> also, hello there, little Terry. Welcome to this very, very special, very, very, very special game. It is very, very special just getting it to run, as you can see. <laughs> yeah. That's actually the main reason why I haven't decided to play this earlier. <laughs> I knew it would be special to do. Hello there, hello there indeed. How are you? It's once again Saturday. But since we're playing our Friday stream right now, I will claim it as Friday. Evening, to be precise. Kind of fell unconscious yesterday. <laughs> Came home, sat down, roop, was gone. Yeah, must have been quite tired. I'm back. And we're going to figure out how to play this reasonably. Right, 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 right. So how did we fuck did we get here? Yeah, that's a good question to start off with, like. You've been slipping in and out of consciousness for a couple of days now, so I imagine you're pretty confused about things. But try not to worry. Uh huh. Safe, at least for the moment. Yeah, sure. We're that's nothing to worry about. Planet of Terrace. We banged up pretty bad when our skate pod crashed. But luckily, I wasn't seriously hurt. I was able to drag you away from our crash site and all the confusion, and I stumbled into this abandoned apartment. By the time the Sith arrived on the scene, we were long gone. Mm, that's if you say. Terrace is under Sith control. Mm -hmm. The fleet mm -hmm. is orbiting the planet. They've declared martial law and they've imposed a planet wide quarantine. But I've been in poor spots. I saw in your service so you say. that you understand a remarkable number of alien languages. That's pretty rare in a raw recruit. But it should come in handy while we're stranded on right. the planet. Alright, there's something maybe for no the Republic will be able nice to do it. Thank you for that. We're going to drop by. Gonna find Bastila and get off this planet. We can't rely on anybody but ourselves. I'm also probably not gonna do a too long one because you know introduction chapter. We're playing baby two hours or so. Ah. <laughs> so why is it so important to find Bastila? That smacked your head did more damage than I thought. Bastila's Don't be such an insulting to a poor person with amnesia. That killed Darth Revan, Malik's Sith master. Bastila's I highly doubt it. The whole Republic war effort. The Sith must have found out that she was on the Endor Spire and set an ambush for us in this system. I believe Bastila mm -hmm. was on one of the escape pods that crashed down here in Terrace. For the sake of the Republic war effort, we have to try and find her. Uh-huh. How can one person, even a Jedi, be so important? Bastila is no ordinary Jedi. She has a rare gift the Jedi call battle meditation. Bastila's power can influence entire armies. It should not be possible. Bastila can inspire her allies with confidence and make her enemies lose their will to fight. Often that's all it takes to tip the balance. Of You're not against of course, overwhelming numbers, though. To what she can do, but from what I understand of her ability, it requires great concentration and focus to maintain her battle meditation. The attack on the Endar Spire which does mean so that it is absolutely useless in absolute in, in action in our combat. Just, just the very moment she gets involved in combat or gets attacked, her battle meditation is going to be broken anyway, which makes her a fucking prime target. As soon as the enemy realizes what she's doing. Oh, yeah. Hmm, hmm. 
Best such as Eddie. She can probably look after herself. Vastel's gonna need our help. Many of Darth Malak's followers can use the dark side of the Force, and the Sith have already Technically, anyone for a sensitive can use dark side Nobody powers. Nobody will be looking they for a couple to. of common soldiers like us, and if we're careful, we can move about the planet without attracting notice. A luxury Bastila won't have. She's gonna have half the Sith fleet looking for her. You might see how important she is to the war effort. The whole planet is under quarantine. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Land or take off. So if Bastila's gonna escape Terrace, she's gonna need our help, and we'll probably need hers. <laughs> oh, let's start being a mercenary right off the bat. You're like, what's in it for me? You mean besides a chance to get off this planet before the Sith find you? Yeah, kind of. Do you have any idea what the Sith do to prisoners of war? You better make it worth my while, boy. Oh, I get it. Never mind that the Sith will destroy the Republic and ravage the galaxy. You're only in this for the credits. Indeed. Don't worry, the Republic pays its mercenaries. You help me find Bastila, and they'll make it more than worth your while, I'm sure. Plus, it might be your only chance to get off Terrace. Also, I could just join the Sith, you know. If I asked him nicely, I'm pretty sure they would take me up. I'm huh. getting under line, as I guess I can help you, but Mr. Good. We're gonna need to work together if we're gonna survive. While you were out, I did some scouting around. Mm -hmm. There are reports of a couple of skate pods crashing down into the Undercity. It's probably a good place to start. But the Undercity's a dangerous place. I don't want to go there unprepared, and it won't do Bastila any good if we go and get ourselves killed. Yeah, but... Uh, let me ask I'll tell you whatever I can, though I, I don't know how much help it'll be. Hmm. What do you know about Malak and Deceif? Everything I know about Malak is pretty much common knowledge. He escaped the trap that killed Darth Revan, his Sith Master. With Revan's death, Malak became the new Dark Lord. It's obvious that Malak's a ruthless tyrant who'll crush anyone who stands in his way, mm -hmm. just like Revan was. Experience has shown that the Sith won't stop until the Republic lies in ruins. Malak and his Sith don't respect anything except raw, brutal power. It's hard to imagine how someone who used to be a Jedi could become such a monster. You'd be surprised. They all have it in themselves. A Jedi, what do you mean? Malak and Revan were once both part of the Jedi Order, but mm -hmm. they were young and headstrong, and against the wishes of the Council, they went to battle the Mandalorians on the Outer Rim. Something happened out there. Something corrupted them and drew them over to the dark side. Or maybe there was something rotten inside them all along. I don't know. Yeah, they what was the alternative the Jedi proposed against the Mandalorian threat? Jedi We're just gonna sit here and, you know, with little thumbs. totally going to help the people die out there. But even that didn't slow the Sith down. Malak just stepped in and assumed Revan's role. He took control of the Sith Armada and resumed the bloody conquest of the Outer Worlds. Are you expecting anything else, actually? To ask I'll tell you whatever I can, though. I, I don't... Yeah, yeah, yeah. What can you tell me about the planet? Taurus was once a magnificent planet-wide metropolis of towering skyscrapers. That was a long time ago. The upper city where the rich citizens live is is still pretty safe. Mm -hmm. If it wasn't for the Sith occupation and the planet-wide quarantine, it might not even be a bad place to live. But farther down, things have degenerated. The, the lower city is nothing but a slum overrun by swoop bike gangs, waging a never-ending war for control. And the Undercity is... Well, it's even worse. The lowest level of Terrace is a wasteland overrun by rat ghouls. Mindless what were you expecting when you build a planet wide spreading city? I've already entered city. all this info into your data pad, oh, tell me more about yourself, Kaf. I understand why you want to know more about me. I... I kind of get the feeling we'll be spending a lot of time together over the next while. But this isn't really the best time for long introductions. We should stay focused on the task at hand. Mm -hmm. There'll be a time for that later. We we'll start looking. Good better. idea. We can use this abandoned apartment as a base. We can probably get some equipment and supplies here in the upper city. Just remember to keep a low profile. I've heard some grim stories about the Dark Jedi interrogation techniques. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Force can do terrible things to a mind. Wipe away your memories and destroy your very identity. Oh, but I figure oh, if we don't oh. do anything stupid, don't say. we should be okay. I mean, after all, they're, they're looking for Basila, not a couple of grunts like us. All right, soldier, let's move out. Aren't you supposed to be some sort of big shot hero, basically? Don't you think they would be after you too? Yes. Play weapons. Oh, should I have a Put in a thing. Set. Very important. Yep. Such a nice little thing you should have in your game. Okay, do I have anything else? I'm not gonna go for 
dual wielding because that's gay. Anything yes, he has to say? And me. Well, I've been a star pilot for the Republic for years. Seen more than my share of wars. I fought in the Mandalorian Wars before all this started. Me? With all Pretty that, sure I've never experienced cool. anything like the slaughter these Sith animals can unleash. Not even the Mandalorians were that senseless. My home world was one of the first planets to fall to Malak's fleet. The Sith bombed it into submission, and there wasn't mm -hmm. a damn thing our Republic forces could do to stop them. <laughs> Don't make it your fault. It shouldn't be my fault. I did everything I could. I followed my orders and did my duty. That that shouldn't mean I failed them. I, I didn't. Very defensively. Them. They mean to be looking over. Yeah, no, I. That's not what I mean. I mean, I, I'm sorry. I'm not making much sense. I not really. Probably mean well with your questions. I'm just not accustomed to talking about my past very much, at all. Actually, I'm more used to taking action, keeping my mind focused on mm -hmm. the business mm -hmm. at hand. So let's just do that. If you have more questions, ask them later. Sure. I'm gonna ask you yes, again. Yes. What's on your mind? Okay. You got it. Game is yes, what's on your mind? That was you got it. Game's like, nah, nah, I'm not gonna tell you anything else. Ugh, he's a good person. Disgusting. Light side person. Right, you alien scum. Everybody get up against the wall. This is a raid. A raid. <laughs> You really suck at shooting. Three shots fired. That's what how is? we sit deep with smart mouth aliens. Now the rest of you get up against the wall before I lose my temper again. Oh. What's this? Humans hiding out with aliens. They're Republic fugitives. Attack! Trrr. <laughs> Yes, yes. Maybe somebody comes searching for this petrol Mm-hmm. They're just gonna randomly take care of the bodies. Like, okay. Fine, sure, if you can do it so. 